Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We had the Dow Industrials finish up 185, NASDAQ up 23, S&Ps up 9.5. They all made all-time highs, folks. The bottom line, if we get over and we take a look at the S&P first, what you're going to see uh, inside this uh, S&P, uh, we'll take a look at the SPY. Uh, SPY out here today got, got up into a price point of $309.65. You're closing at $308.21 and $308.00. Well, bottom line, 308.21 is fine. It's over, the, it's over all those highs. So bottom line is that it's saying flat out, you do not have a failure inside the S&P 500. We go look at the NDX 100, bottom line inside the three Qs. You got to a price point today of $201.72. You're closing out at $200.43. Now, that's a failure in price because the bottom line is that you had got over the highs that were generated out here on Tuesday. You closed underneath them. Your bottom line is that you uh, had uh, 3 million shares less, 16 million versus 13 million. Uh, and the small caps, small caps basically sold off uh, all day. Small caps, uh, you know, of course, the, the highs in the small caps go all the way back to July of 2018. What the small caps did out here today, if we take a look at the IWM, you're up 44 cents. Never made it to the high that was generated out here on Tuesday, which was the 160.46. You got the 160.17 today. You closed out at 158, the 67. Uh, that was the top of this range. The top of this range that we've been in, folks, inside the small caps, this has been a long time. We've been in this trading range since October of 2018. So we're talking a full year that you've been in this trading range. That was after it came off the high of $173. Bottom line, we'll see what's going to back off. You know, we've been up here four different times in the last 12, well, 13 months right now. Uh, bottom line, though, the way that is set up is that uh, that is set up right now that it wants to go down the lower end of that range. Disney. Disney's going to be coming out with his numbers uh, right after the close. Well, the close now, next uh, five minutes. Disney is trading at 133.12. They're expecting a five-point move, either higher or lower, when those numbers come out. To recap out here, we had the Dow, NASDAQ, S&Ps all hit an all-time high. That being said, uh, what you do have is that you had the NDX 100, the NASDAQ composite as that they were a failure. You can expect those to pull back. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. We look forward to speaking to right here tomorrow.